discuss because we have to improve quite a lot in both this area both with finance and membership mm. and uh, Lily made a great start yesterday but we have to take it further and make it happen uh, and this we have to we have to uh, share with each other inspire each other find ways to do uh, exercise we are going to get in a, in a certain frame of mind and heart and then we are going to do the goal setting together. So I'm going to take you through some, <coughs> some uh, information and hints and so on. So we will come back and put in an amount there. <coughs> and then we, we want like I said, we want to do it together and really hit the, that goal of what we made. So, now I want to just take you into another area where about goal setting really and how it works and what we can do. But this is just sums it up really. It's a, uh, a quote from Lisa Langelo, I saw the angel in the marble and I carved until I set him free. That's where we have to get, we have to, we have to get, have the goal clearly in our mind and separate it from it. We have to let it go. Mm. Yeah. But, but, but he, he worked, so we, that is a job and that job is different for each of you, wherever you are at in yourself, but, but we have to do the job to, to get to where we see the goal in our mind, feel it, and, and so on, I get back to that. Um, so, I introduce you to the penthouse, the 12 story building, and this is our inner floors. And uh, so, <clears throat> so we want to meet up in the penthouse and then we do our goal setting. So how do we get there? And then what, what is it like up there? <laughs> So like I said, it, it's a different way for each person. Um, so I, I will, I will get, I also will get back to this one. To, I will get back to how do we get there. Yeah, I hope I haven't <laughs> forgotten something. Okay, so what's it like in the penthouse? We have a clear vision. We see the, clear, the goal clearly in our mind. And we have an absolute intention. We have to intend what we want. 
and <laughs> intention is consist of a true desire so you must have a true desire to have that what you have chosen to visualize and you have to believe it the more you believe in your chosen goal the, and the possibility of attaining it the more confident you will be to do so and you feel in yourself if you believe it or not and if you don't you have to work on that one and then you must accept it you must be willing to accept and have that what you are seeking and that is a big deal because we may we sometimes we make our goal and then we are scared of getting it you know so so we really have to check ourselves a bit and no attachment we let it go um so here we are in the penthouse together and we do that goal together <coughs> so how do we get to the penthouse i'll go more into that so we, here on the first floor our life revolves around ourselves and our five physical senses and what i feel and what i think and the smells and the everything oh sorry i should go back and so uh, and then as we move up verse our vision changes so we have to ask ourselves in this moment here where you are sitting now from what attitude do you view your life right now how do you look at each other how do you look at the world how do you look at your life your world, whatever <coughs> And then also we have to consider what kind of energy we are we are generating or what are we giving out? What are we what is our energy, our personal energy? So here on the first floor everything is literal and personal perception and interpretation of what is happening in your life you take everything personal it's all about you and then as you go up the floors you know you can say for every floor you move up your capacity to perceive and interpret something because becomes more symbolic than literal you don't take things so personal anymore and when you're up there in the penthouse symbolic and impersonal perception and interpretation of what is <coughs> happening in your life you can see you can see things from a very different perspective and, and, and you don't take it personal because life really isn't so personal <laughs> that's a statement <coughs> so and, and then um, I don't know if I have an extra slide for that but how do, how do we get how do we get from here how do we get up the floor so that is very different from for each person and maybe if you are down here and you know there's something going on in your life you have to bash it out so how do, how do you get there and maybe in your mind you think okay i have to find the stairways and i start walking once one floor at a time i walk up and then somebody else can think well well, I'm not walking those floor. I find the elevator. Yeah, and then but then so you take the elevator to sixth floor, 
because there is something or somebody, you know, you, you can't get any further because there is something. So you have to sort that out. And for some people, you hear, you find the elevator, and whoop, you are there. <coughs> and, and that can be anything. Sometimes for me, it's just it's a song. You know, it it it, it can be anything that really moves your heart and takes you to that higher level. So now we are going to do a detour, and I mentioned something about energy, and I'm going to go through that first part of it quickly because you all know it, but I'm going to talk to you as you don't know anything, <laughs> because, because I don't know. So, so I have to, I have to switch on that. And here it is again. So this is what we want. Um, the power of imagination. <coughs> Keep in mind that the process of creation starts at the point of imagining something. Mm -hmm. Your thoughts are that powerful. You, you, you think something and you have started the process of creation. That is a scary thought, really. <clears throat> and then we have to keep in mind light and dense en energy. We learn the chemistry that the building blocks are molecules, atoms, particles, which is energy and are not separate at all. So you have dense energy, you have um, light energy. And so it's heavy to move that stone, but on the level of our thoughts, the, the energy is very light and we can change it like that. So I'm walking down the high street in, in Harrow <laughs> and I'm on the way to Debenhams, which is down there at the turn, it's down there. And then I walk and, I, and then I see something in the shop window and I turn around. That's all it takes to change the, the thought energy. Yeah. So that we have to keep in mind. And then we also need to know that all energy runs in circuits. So the more positive energy we put into imagining what we want, the more it begins to manifest in our lives. Try it on for size, write down a simple thought you like to set in motion, date it, and then go back and check it. So, so en energy just is, you know, and, and, and also energy is magnetic. Thoughts and feelings have specific magnetic energy which attracts the energy of a similar nature. And we all are experienced, we think of somebody and the phone rings. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it's this kind of thing. But it also works on in everything, energy just is magnetic. So that's another thing, you know. And here I am, using out my my energy, and boom, it comes back to me, you know. And this one, we also know very well, form follows ID. So just having an ID or thought in your mind is an energy which will attract and create that form on the material plane. And then, you know, with the artist, also if you have a clear, if he have a clear uh, idea in his mind, and he has the right materials and and skill, his his uh, his idea manifests. It's it's being created, if you like, through the process of creation. And, and we know the four position from this, and I don't need to go into it. <coughs> so, what you resist, persist. Most of us have two lives, this is a quote. Most of us have two lives, the life we live 
and the unlived life within us. And between the two stands resistance. And I know that this one very well. <laughs> Maybe you do too, you know. I know I need to do the stretching. I even have the mat on the floor, the yoga mat. <laughs> and I sit down and, and sit on the TV and look at that. <laughs> you know what I mean. Yeah, I feel very, very So, and then situation causing resistance to surface. So, I think often in our life, this is it. We go forward, but we, there is something holding us back. Or, or you know, we have, or you can call it baggage, I don't know. Call it what you like. <laughs> when you set a goal that needs some effort and motivation, resistance surfaces and delay you reaching your goal. Mm -hmm. Because when, when, we, when we make a goal, there are voices telling us, no, no, no. No, you can't do that, or no, you know, all sorts of things, right? So, you can say that this, what is resistance, and of course I don't have all the answers here on this slide, but it's just a start. So resistance <coughs> is a basic part of the fear of change. We don't want to change you know, <laughs> and, and in the past, like I, I told uh, Amanda earlier, I, I used to be an atheist years ago, and but something in me also, this is another aspect, <laughs> in me, we know God exists, but we don't want to have anything to do with him because we know in the moment I realized that my life changed and I saw what we are really doing, we are, we are just resisting that change. And then there is another thing what we do, uh, need to be aware of <coughs> when we are do, doing a goal, we make a list but maybe the things you are writing down is not really a goal. It's mm. just a state of mind, right? So here is, here is um, uh, um, I did this a while ago. So this guy, he says, I'm happy with anything from 40 to 60,000. <coughs> He's happy with that, and, and, and be happy, happy, that's a state, it's a state <laughs> of mind, it's what they want to feel, it's, it's not the goal itself. Mm -hmm. So, he has to say, 60,000 a month after tax by the 15th of December 2020, so this is when I do it. <laughs> so, <clears throat> So uh, um, a state is stated ambiguously, and the goal is stated specifically. So this is what we didn't do last year. So we have to we have to be specific about our goal. And a state is something you can have right now, but to reach a goal takes time. There is time period. And a state, there is no steps. So it's, it's like <coughs> listening to the songs and I'm in the penthouse. You know, that's a good <coughs> And with a goal, there are steps needed. Mm. And uh, uh, with, with a, a state is infinite and goal is measurable. It's exact, and um, a state is, is stated for yourself or somebody else, but a real goal is stated only for yourself. 
Because if it, it's you, and it's your energy, and it's your everything, it's in you. So you can't be in anyone else, you know, you can't make a door close somebody. Um, and the state is unwritten and unclarified, <coughs> and the law <coughs> is written down. So these are also things we need to keep in mind. And then we have what we call dwarfs and away guards. Because I think a lot of the time we do away, away goals, which is a goal to get rid of a bad habit. And a towards goal, it's something you desire to become, and it's a different. So that we have to keep in mind. So we want to lose weight, yes. we want to quit smoking, and we want to spend less on things we don't need. So these are the away goals. So then we are focusing, we are, we, are, we are sending our energy to that what we don't want. And that is the process of creation. So we're creating more of what we don't want, basically. <coughs> so here is the fourth goal, the equivalence. So <coughs> instead of say we want to lose weight, we say we, we want to focus on eating healthy food and exercise. Or quit smoking, we have to think, you know, what we are doing, we are taking care of our lungs. Mm -hmm. And of course in return the rest of our body. And then we want to spend less things on things we don't need. But what we want to do is to save money for, for things we dream of. So, so that, that is a big difference of how we state our goals. And then there is the smart goals, and this is used a lot in business and in, uh, anywhere, in, in goal-setting situations. Well, this is just a quote from Tony Robbins. Setting goal is the first step in turning the invisible into visible. But the smart goal, the, it's the same things. It has to be specific, measurable, attainable, uh, reachable, and time-based. So we have to think smart, right? So that's you looking yourself in the mirror in the morning. I, I certainly didn't do that this morning. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Uh, I love myself. Do you say that sometimes? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Marilyn. <laughs> because you want people to love you. Love you. Of course. You don't want to love you, but you want others yeah. to do it. Yeah. <laughs> love you, Marilyn. <laughs> right. So, so here we have to write down our goals, and I, I use affirmations a lot. And I mean, I have a. I have a very strong personal testimony with using affirmations, which goes 40 years back when I was in Dasko. I had a nervous breakdown. I didn't know that was going on. And I didn't have a diagnosis then, and I didn't go to the doctor and what have you. But I came across, or a friend gave me this little book, the Creative Visualization, it's called. <coughs> and uh, and uh, and if that is all about energy and affirmations, so I've, I've used that for what it's worth, and I, I, it took some years actually, but I brought myself out of that, whatever it was, by using affirmations, so I, I really, I know it works. Um, 
So here is some affirmation. We must celebrate in Europe activities of generating da 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 by December 31st, 24th. So that's what we <coughs> want. <coughs> so here is another level because, you know, a change happens on the unconscious level. Change doesn't happen externally, does it? So, so when we want to change something, something in here has to change, and we, we, want, we want to get down to the unconscious level. See? This is, so this is, is a question sequence. Actually, there is 17 questions that brings us from the conscious level to the unconscious level. It's questions that we ask and we have to think about it. And uh, um, so this is better to do when we have the goal. So anyway, I'll show you. Um, so so question sequence. <coughs> Sequence. I, I need it. So is question sequence tailored to help remove concepts, resistances, and fears you might have, even unconsciously, that stops you from reaching and manifesting your goal? Right? So, <laughs> you know. In, in goal setting, I think the, the goals are already in here, but we have to connect to them. That, that's how I really think. But then the, 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 there is all these disturbances that we have to kind of get rid of to find that goal and bring it out. So we have to check if the goals are congruently desirable. So we have to ask ourselves, so this we will do with the goal that we, that, that we are uh, unanimously agreeing on a bit later. So what will this outcome get for me and allow me to do? And we have to identify the resources we need. What do you have now and what do you need to get your outcome? And then we <coughs> have to ensure that the goal is ecological. Why do we want this goal? Is it a goal that's going to be harmful to somebody? No. You know, so we have to check ourselves. Um, and then what will happen if we get the goal? So now we are moving, now we are moving more inwards. Um, what will happen if you don't get it? I'm going to go quickly through this with you. That's why you have the sheet of paper that we are going to use it a bit later. <coughs> so what won't, what won't happen if you get it? No. What won't happen if you don't get it? Um, yeah, I think I think I. I, went a bit too, I think I went too quick. So how long time do I have left? And now you have. Uh, okay. Unless you have discussions. Uh, now you have uh, yeah, yeah so now we have okay so uh, uh, so what will happen if you get it what won't happen if you get it what will happen if you don't get it what won't happen if you don't get it? Yeah, oh, okay, I didn't go any. Scared of getting it. 
Sure. Yeah, I, I was a bit lost when you said we set the goal for 60,000. Yeah. And we went over it. Yeah. Where did we go over it? Because all the money that came into our account was 72,000. Was it? Yeah. Let me explain it. We had this money from the account. Because I saw 36,450 and some donations. Yeah, okay. that, that didn't add up anyhow. Well, I didn't see it. Okay, so where are we? I have to go back. Yeah, but maybe just explain shortly. I have to go here. Okay, so that is that is the the money that came in from our general. That was that was clear enough. But then here for you and. 28,000 came oh, in. Oh, okay. Then, uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah. And yeah. for Ukraine, 3,009 right, yeah. came in. Yeah, I guess it is. So, so that, that, you, you got yeah. it? Yeah. So, so <coughs> what are questions? She has a question. Yeah. Just at the moment, I saw how much money is available in the account. Yeah. Because you said some in Korea and some for Ukraine. So, what is the remaining? No, no, yeah. So in the account is four thousand five eighty five seventy three. Yeah. So, so, that, so that is already taken out for for, for Ukraine. And no, 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 no. So I'm I'm not including in the account. I, here, here I'm I'm sh I'm showing I'm, I'm showing that as a separate something, but it happens to be zero here. So this the mark. It maybe maybe next year that is that is has money come into you, you the you, for Ukraine and maybe it would say a thousand euros there. Okay, a question was in this four thousand because we cannot see the, the number here. Yeah, four thousand so something is not including Ukraine's donation. No, 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 no but it could. It's it's yeah, not. but it could be because we have paid. Everything we no. owe yeah. to, to no. Ukraine. Okay. We didn't yeah, send it all the money. We didn't send it. We sent it. We sent it. So that's what is left now. Yeah. So yeah. it's free. There's a there's a money. Yeah. 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 So it's free. It's tangible yeah. money we have. Okay. Yes. Yeah. 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 But but in, in case uh, let's say we let's say there was a thousand crown uh, not crown but euros <laughs> um, that we hadn't paid. Yeah. So yeah. then it would say one thousand here. Mm -hmm. Then it would say five thousand five eighty five. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So so it be that one minus what we owe. Okay. Yeah. We don't owe anything. We don't, we don't owe anything. anything. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. And how is it with this one thousand six hundred minus from Cyprus? Uh, is it only to go to Europe paying, or shall we pay those who were there? No, 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 no. no, no. It, it, it's, it, it's, it's just part of the income statement. Yeah, yeah. So, 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 I mean, so, so it's, it's used and what have you. Mm -hmm. So it, it money come in and money gone out and it come out of the bank and it's mm -hmm. part of, of the, the balance we have in the bank. I can say something that what we can learn from this event we had is that these expenses is something that we did not really enough 
If you've got the questions, maybe everybody's interested so we can all hear because when you talk amongst yourself, it might just be the issues that everybody's so interested in. So, so, okay, so we have 20 minutes left. Uh, but we want to talk about membership too. So now I, I want you to do whatever you have to do to uh, just to, to to feel in your intuitive mind um, a, a goal for this year, financial goal, an amount. And then you write that amount on the blank paper you got. And then, and then we will see. So, 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 just do what you have to do in, in your head. So, this is a goal for the European Women Federation, or nationally a goal? No, no, we are Women's, we, we we are are women's Federation Europe. This is a count for Women's Federation Europe. We want the goal for Women's Federation Europe. And money coming in, so specifically. And then what, 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 what we want? We want actual income, we want money coming through with the name Yeah, hang on, let me just. Okay. No. You have done it, hold your paper up. So, do you want to go around and just read the numbers?
Mo? Oh, AG Tassels. Cartoon Tassels. AG Is the toll coming in, or the the what is left at the end? Yes. We, we, talk, we talk about money. We talk about money that is that is coming into our women's federation account, which is yeah. generated from women's federation activities. Right. Total no. coming in. Yeah. Yeah. So it's nothing During the to year. do with money coming from UN or no, from no, no, because, but, because but money generated from activities that we do, whatever they are, right, and donations and sponsorship, right, and however it comes, yeah, okay. Right, we got the goal. What? Eighty thousand, okay. Yes. I think it's yes. 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 Hands up if you agree to 80,000. Is that most? That's exactly 50%. Exactly, yeah. yeah. <laughs> same number yeah. so don't use your mind you use your mind if you said one million yeah. right no my heart wants one million it's not the, the, the mind, mind one million. Million. Yeah. but also you have to keep in mind these goals have to be realistic it has to be a, you know, so, so but, how do we do it? Like this? Yeah. I think your presentation was so excellent for us to understand how to get there. So my intuitive mind said a, a number that was a little bit higher than that, than 80,000. Okay. I was surprised. Okay. So that's why I think we should aim a little bit higher. We have to do it again, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But um, uh, will you promise you do it in your own time at home? And then and then you send No no no, no, no. Yeah. no. Okay. Collective. Collective. Yeah. Okay. So we we okay. We do the eighty thousand, and it, it it might be hundred and fifty in the end. Okay. Keep this 
for next year yeah. as evidence. Mm. Okay. Yeah. No, I, I think <laughs> we should give another number and maybe more people will agree. Yeah, we'll see. You give us 90,000. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, 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 hundred. Say hundred. Hundred thousand. Hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. Carol, count. <laughs> Slowly come back, slowly come back. <clears throat> so, you let go that it's finished. <laughs> <laughs> And then uh, there is no this part is finished. So no no um session about membership. So there is no time. So I'm just going to race through, throw out the questions, and then at some point we, we have to do a Zoom or something to um, um, to, to watch. To, to 
read this one. Thank you. <laughs> so I'll, I'll just put it up as membership discussion points, and of course, um, uh, Lily addressed uh, things yesterday about that. So, pass new seat back. Forms of membership, we have general membership, partnership, sponsorship. That's what we have at the moment, which is reflected on the website. This is us, and, and this is our vast area. Look at it. And then, and, and then I've, just, I've just thrown in a number. But we are not many members. In each country, there are maybe 30 or 40 or 80 or... So it's not many members. And, and that's a bit shocking. So we have to address how to increase the membership. So paid members, paid members. Not so many paid members. No, not paid. So, so then we, that's another question. We, we, we can define what we what is a member. We have to define what is a member, you know. But I'm talking about paid membership mm -hmm. because membership is at the moment anyway our biggest source of income, mm -hmm. you know. So even for that reason we need to. Um, so um, so at the moment we have uh, individual country membership and then we on the website we have a, a membership structure and 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 it might be a bit confusing i think you know so so is it member like you said in, in the country or is it europe or but but somehow we have to find a way you know where it's clear it, you know national and European membership, we have to clarify that. I think any, any website of an organization has a membership site. Yes. So it has to be there. Yeah. Because that, not everyone, you know, the new people, yeah. they don't know a chapter. Yeah. They come through that avenue. You know? Yeah. We need so to in 2023, there was one person who signed up. So we made a start. <laughs> National, uh, we need to uh, develop our national membership yeah. able to help the European membership. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If we don't develop the national membership, we cannot help the European membership. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So that's very first of all of priority for me will be to develop the national membership. Yeah. 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 What about tithing? What about 10% of national membership going no, 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 to the European? This is at least main thing to increase that membership at yeah. different levels and maybe at different categories of membership. And yeah. So there, there, there are many suggestions. The question behind how do you address that? Huh? There's a question behind. I'm sorry. Leave this. I ju <laughs> hey. Hey. <laughs> I just think we have to separate on a national level between membership amount of members and the national um, membership in Europe. No, economy. You understand? Yeah. I know this is very controversial. Can I say it with yeah. Pavy? Yeah. But Pavy actually, uh, she she has now created a way. So in the tithing that members do in the family federation, they can actually choose the tithing to go either to women federation or to um, family federation. And that is an agreement with the. Should that do? Sorry, but should that do like this? What? No, no, I know, but I, I just. No, no, just I'm just sharing, <laughs> with the agreement and the discussion with the head of family federation. With the agreement. Huh? With the agreement. Of course. Yeah. You can't yeah, yeah. do it without. Right. <laughs> so, but to me, when I heard it, I never even thought in a line like that. But so, so I'm just saying it's a bit controversial. Or, but or if it is a providential, or or something. no, 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 no. People, it's up to completely up to each person mm -hmm. to decide where is the, the tithing going to. Because Women Federation, she feels, considering the most important 
So I'm just saying, this is Peggy. She blew me away. I just talked to her a few days ago. Exactly. No, no, no. Exactly, but it's a right. Concept. We don't yeah. need to call it tithing. But for members, yeah, for members to be able to do it, they, they, you, you know, because our thinking is like so religious, huh? With the tithing. Mm. So that's why I use it as the word tithing. No, no, we don't have to use it. I mean, in women in nuclear, we do the same. We don't call it tithing, but every chapter pays to the international. I, I know this is a big area of discussion. <laughs> but can I just throw a few more sorry. questions out? I'm sorry. And then we, have, no. we definitely need a longer session to discuss it all, isn't it? was my idea years so, ago, mm -hmm. but nobody listened. Um, yeah, so this was, I wanted to do it here and now, but we can't. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so, yeah, this is just the, the three, um, the three um, themes. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I, it's no time to... So, but, but then, if I sum up, um, I just, this is, I asked, I sent uh, uh, on WhatsApp, please send me the number of how many people you are influencing, even if you have very few people, how many people are you influencing in the, in the year? And this is totally random because I only got a couple of answers, but I wanted to show, yeah, we are, 800 people, but we influence 70,000 people. You know, but we, we have to we have to keep a track of the things we are doing. Where does it go? Who, how many does it do we need? Maybe we are spending a lot of resources and on something that doesn't go very far. So we, we have to understand what we are doing. Um, and then, yeah, so here also I wanted to write down what is, what do we want, you know, what is it we really want? And then I wanted to end on a nice note. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Shakespeare's, I think this was great, and he says, and this our life, exempt from public haunt, pines, tongues in trees, books in the running brooks, sermons in stones, and good in everything. Thank you. Bless you all. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. No, no, I'm going to get it right now. We finished here. Yeah, yeah I, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, just, uh, I just, uh, I, I'm sure sisters have it right, but I just want to make it sure. One thing is the membership of each country. The membership of each country is a member of the International Federation, and for that we pay our fee. That's one thing. And then we are talking about making members, membership in terms of increasing the numbers of associates, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And uh, of course, uh, this is what we can do nationally. Mm -hmm. And our goal is to educate people so yeah. that they come to that point, they want to really be a member and they understand us yeah. as far yeah. as they can, mm -hmm. up to two terms. Yeah. So, uh, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. I don't know what is, the difficulty there. What is? <coughs> what are we discussing exactly? I think what I found that we need to have in our mind the goal to um, develop a membership to outside people, mm -hmm. to ambassador to things. Mm -hmm. That's what you said just now. But to have this kind of goal to uh, to increase our membership, not just only among our members, of course, mm -hmm. but to really increase it to. Uh, I, because also yeah, yeah, we, need, we need finance on the national level and we need to increase the number yeah, and the pay. And I know 
Like the coins, like the euro coin. <laughs>
talked about yeah. this. I mean, Story Story, it has to be a new session, mm -hmm. uh, also. Mm -hmm. um, then, uh, no Peace Without, without Women. No Peace Without Women, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so many times. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. People send you that song, though. <sighs> I know we've got the Ukraine, which is done great for that. Can you send to everybody? Yes. Yeah, they can, we can send the link um, with, sure with, with, with the one. different mm -hmm. things. And also, we'll stop that in brainstorming. Because those events actually are very good to target membership towards, because if you bring a group, group of women, you know, find them up to go and then you have them and they come to one of those events they're very interested so it could be a, a target for the first of activity for membership before the event mm. okay it's okay. really good so it's uh, just one minute to 11 so we go out straight out to the floor yeah. and mm -hmm. then we're back for 20 past 11. Yes, that's right. We'll be going to the next one. 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 We'll be going to the